Hello my YouTube friends, YouTube fam, here's a little quick update on what's going on right now. I know some of you guys are asking why are the videos coming out later than when I record them. I mean this video in particular, this vlog is like a month old. Bear with me. Um, I know most of you guys know this but some of you guys don't. We had this huge studio move from Santa Monica to Calabasas and if you guys know about studio moves, it's a ton of work. It's, it, there's all that gear, all the wiring, all the cables, all that stuff. Everything's got to be transported and plugged in, all that stuff. So it's a crazy, crazy move and it takes a lot of time. There's that and also I had to buy a bunch of new equipment for the new studio. A new video mixer, cameras and all that stuff. And if any of you guys know gear, which I'm sure a lot of you guys watching probably do know about gear, you can't just plug it in and you're, and you're good to go. You have to program stuff, you have to dial in settings and all that stuff. So that's been taking up a bunch of my time. And also we started a show called The Calabasas Fight Companion, which um, if you saw the previous vlog, you'll see how much you know how much goes into that. I'm doing a concert for the first time in I don't know how many years, but I'm doing a concert with Lil Browse. Uh, I'm, I'm, we're actually doing like three concerts, but the first one's gonna be next week. Today is Thursday, August 12th. So our first concert's gonna be next Saturday, August 21st in Ohio of all places. That's where Austin is from. So that's our first one. Then we have one in Phoenix, I think September 18th, and then at a place called Rebel Lounge. And then the weekend after that in Texas, Austin, Texas. I'm not sure we're in Texas yet though. But I mean, so we have these concerts lined up. There's like so much stuff that's involved with that, right? We have rehearsals every week. We were doing our set list every week. And anyway, so for ticket information for the first concert in Ohio, I'll leave it down below in the description box. Um, so we had that going on. There's a ton of stuff going on. And I promise you guys that I love making these videos. This is not something I do for financial gain because if you saw the checks I made from YouTube, you would not laugh, but it would you would be like surprised. I'll tell you this right now. For the last few months, I have seen checks for the entire month for like 279 or 200 and something like that. For the entire month of making videos and editing and filming and all that stuff. This is more of a passion project of mine because I remember when I was, you know, in the in my car listening to my favorite podcasts and then even watching my favorite podcasts on YouTube, I would always wonder what kind of mics, what kind of you know, audio gear and how does it what's the behind the scenes stuff look like? So that's why I'm doing this. I'm trying to do what I wanted to see back then for you guys. Anyways, that being said, hopefully you guys understand now why these videos are coming out later than I would like. But my goal is to make sure that I can shorten the gap between the time I film the videos and then publish the videos. Man, I have so much footage in the hard drives. And uh, as soon as I have a little crack, a little opening of time to edit and you know get these videos out, I will, believe me. So please just understand and enjoy the videos. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for always supporting me and everything I do. You guys are the best. So anyways, come out to the shows. We would love to see you. I'll post stuff on Instagram as soon as I know more details about the future shows. But yeah, the one coming up next week in Ohio. It's our first one. It's going to be crazy. It's a huge place too, which is so nerve wracking. But anyways, that I'm done. Enjoy the video. Love you guys. Take care. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, you're live. We live? What's up, fam? Here is the first ever Calabasas Fight Companion, and I'm here with the boys. Fight Companion for UFC 246, Connor versus Dustin Poirier. To my left is the man, the myth, the legend, UFC royalty, the former champion of the UFC, Cody Garbrandt. What's up, brother? Thanks for answering the call. Over there, directly across, is the living legend himself. The living legend, oh, Bradley shit. Martin. Oh, <laughs> oh, Why are you pointing to me, bro? I don't it's a, it's all you, bro. No, you know like, what's up, I, I am the old, YouTube by the way. Himself. Yeah. You said legend, and you just pointed to me no, like you're, I was you're, old. You're MMA royalty. Oh, you thank know you, this. Thank you. I yes, love MMA royalty, Josh Thompson. Also, one half of the podcast weighing in. Yes. You guys are crushing it, man. We are. We're, We're doing really shows. well, man. Uh, Big John McCarthy and I do a show together. Just... We just broke uh, 100,000 subscribers, so we're just picking Ooh, up, man. Big deal. Thing, yeah. oh, this is, I'm, You're I'm the, the one that wants to see it. You're the one that wants to see it. I'm the, I'm we the need people. to entertain them. I get what he's saying. Exactly. I understand. That's, that's where the sport's going. That's right. where it's hard for us. Because we're like, exactly. what is for you. But you're the bold. Yeah. I, 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 I'm with what's going to get them the most eyeballs, make them the most money, it. and be the easiest right. shot at the title. Yeah. Yeah. Josh, how you came up? The fight campaign is going on right now. And you're you under know, my desk, which is a uh, desk slash bar. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. So far, it's going good. The volume apparently on YouTube is not too loud. So so there's there's only so much I can do for my own. No, so I'm also taking a lot of tea. I'm 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 taking a lot
But it's a yeah, fight. Let's see how this it goes. But so far, it seems cool. Yeah. 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 Check out all the new stuff they sent me and I'll show you some old goodies too. All the new stuff they sent me, this floral pattern. Remember, these are premium tees, so the fabric is insanely good and it's shrink resistant. This one that is probably a panda, but it looks like a fish. That's why I love this. Astronaut snowboarding. This reminds me of some sort of mushroom trip. Never had one. An astronaut playing a video game. This looks very California, which I love. Here's a long sleeve and I'm telling you the fabric on this is insanely good. And everyone knows I love joggers, so check how cool these are. It has like reflective riding too. And if you recall, these are my old favorites. Skeleton inside a pill bottle. This one I love because how much the colors pop. This is sick too. 10% off the entire site. Just go to intotheam.com slash chin. That's AM like AM PM. Or just click the link in the description box below. Thank you guys. I know. We can turn it up now. We can turn it up now. Oh, turn it on now. Yeah, we can. We can. Look at Rogan, man. He's a dog. Just sit down there next to him. Yo, cuddle buddies. We're cut. We're turning up. Yeah. All right. We can still rewind it and play back. Yeah, yeah. Nice, nice. Can we rewind it? Yeah, we can. We can. Yeah, for sure. That must hurt so much. I can't imagine. Sponsors. This is what's gonna make them more money. You know, for a bigger paydays. I'm not mad at them for that. They shouldn't be mad at them. These fighters owe him a little bit of the tip of the hat and saying, hey, thank you. Because you guys are all getting paid more money because of him. Am I right or am I wrong? Good morning. It's Sunday, July 11th, the day after the very first ever Calabasas Fight Companion, which I gotta say, it went way better than I expected because when you do production, especially live production, so many things can happen. It wasn't perfect, but it's a good like first stepping point, first starting off point. So I'm pretty happy about that. Now I gotta drive to the studio in Calabasas, breaking down all the equipment, all the audio equipment, drive back to Santa Monica, and then uh, set up all the equipment, all the audio gear, all the cabling and stuff in the TFAT K studio. So it'll be a pretty long day. We back. Really cool stuff here that Joanna set up for Brendan. Joanna is Brendan's wife, if you guys don't know. That's a cool lamp with bullets inside the vase. Vase. All these balloons. Thick boy balloons here. What the heck is this though? Why is there water here? It must be from the ice, hopefully. Anyhow, I have to take all this audio gear apart. All that stuff as well. My iMac. This whole unit. All done, though. Take a look. So I gotta take all the stuff back to T5K and then set up there. So see you guys there. What the hell are you doing here, Kev? Oh, we back. Take a look at this. You already saw it before, though, but it looks super empty. But it's gonna be nice and full once again. In one, two, three, snap. All right, peoples, we's back in business. 
Got all the mic arms up. I tested all the inputs and everything's working properly. The only thing that sucks here is input three that I have on Chappelle. For whatever reason, the decibel level just isn't as high as the rest. So that's kind of weird. I've got to figure that out. But I have other inputs that I can use in the meantime. Monitor's up and running. Um, all the mic arms here are up. This guy's up. All these are up. That one's up. Everything's connected. We're all oh, who's that? Who that? That's me. That's my YouTube channel. So please subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. We is done for the day as far as setting the studio up. Now I gotta make sure I have all the articles ready for tomorrow's episodes of Blow the Belt and Fighter and the Kid. Monday is here. I feel like I was just here a couple hours ago. I think so. Uh, Isaac, who does those? What do you call those things? What things? Clapper things, clappers. The slate? The slate, yeah. Who writes on them? That's so funny. I never, I've only saw one of them before, but that's so dope. Oh, yeah, I've been doing that. Yeah, I gotta make sure I get all of them next time. <laughs> oh, so fun. What were you saying right now, Kev? So I had a dream about Shin this morning. Mm -hmm. uh, I was in a club. It was in the all club. red. Yeah. And Shin was DJing there. And so uh, Shin didn't have a DJ board. He had four toasters. <laughs> and so when my alarm went off, the toasters sprang up waffles and I woke up. That was it? That was it. <laughs> So you're dreaming of me DJing. I think the reason why you had that because I was sitting at that bar. You know, it looked like a DJ. And then you were also hungry for <laughs> freaking waffles. Too. Yeah. So I think that's what it was. <laughs> it's a beautiful dream though, Kevin. I wish to dream like you one day. <laughs> this long day is finally over. As you can see, everyone's gone right now. I finished everything I have to finish right now. In this studio, TFAK is already uploading right now. But I'm still waiting on Showtime and Malka for the finalized audio. So... That's the last thing I gotta do. I'm gonna head home right now and work on that as soon as I receive it. This is the iconic Abbott Kinney Boulevard area. If you guys are not from here, I'll take you for a little cruise. Abbott Kinney Boulevard. This is cool, a lot of restaurants, stores. Butcher's Daughter, that looks pretty dope. More stuff here and there. Birds, another one, another one of our sponsors. Burrow. This place is a poppin'. What is that? That's really packed. No name on the outside though. What's up guys, Low Browse here. I don't have a lot of time, but I just want to let you know, I'm doing my first live show ever in my hometown, August 21st, Ohio, Vern Rife Center, and I'm coming with a special guest. He was super down, super easy to make it happen. Chin's, exci Chin's excited to sing for you guys. I'm excited to rap for you guys, and we're gonna give you guys a great show. So I hope to see you all there. I told you to stop. Come, hey, get, get back. August 21st, Vern Rife Center, Ohio, eight o'clock p.m. See you guys there, all right. If you stop wiggling, it.
the stress and I'm off all the learning lessons I had to go through the pain and the pain just made me a weapon The weapon turned into armor, I'm feeling like I protected the flesh